Hi, I'm Maddie, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm joined by Greg Fitz. Hello! Greg is a science presenter, and today we're going to be playing the Close Up Christmas Challenge. Do we have like special music for that? Uh, yes. Da, da, da. The idea behind this is that Greg and I have both gotten picked three items. Greg's three are man-made, my three are natural, and we're going to be putting them under my special camera, this here, which is a digital microscope. And a microscope lets us see really small things in close-up. Um, just as a quick example, we're starting things off with a Santa's hat. So just take a look at this on the screen. I think it looks a bit like a wiry beard, don't you? It does. That's amazing. Sheep. Oh, look at that. You can always just see. One strand. One little strand all by itself. Of course now I can just put uh, the Christmas hat on. Greg you've got one as well. For the challenge I'm going to be going first but of course I don't want Greg to be able to see what I'm putting under the camera or, or you, guys. you guys. This is a game after all so I'm just going to cover it up with our wizard's cloak. All right first item. I'm really excited. Da -da -da, number one. Oh wow that's like a mountain isn't it? It's like a rock surface. I Okay, so this bit looks like rock, but this bit looks green. I think it's got to be a leaf. That's correct. Now think Christmassy. What sort of leaf might it be? Ah, that's given it away. So it's a leaf with prickly bits. Is it holly, Maddie? Yes, it was holly. <coughs> Item number two. Are you ready? I'm ready. Oh, wow! Look at that! Do you have any ideas what that is? Well, I can see that it's a star. Okay, it's a star on something. This thing. That looks like a string of some sorts to me. Is it a type of Christmas decoration? I am utterly clueless. That looks like wax. <gasps> is it a candle? Yes! Is it? Yes! No! Look. So this is what you were looking at? This is the candle. It looked like another world, didn't it? It was amazing. It was like, what was it? I never clue that was wax. <laughs> this one's really good. Okay. Can I look? Yeah, yeah you can look yeah. at the screen. Oh, it looks like it's got snow on it. I mean, I reckon... It just looks incredible. Doesn't it look amazing? It looks amazing. Right, I... I think I know what that is. Okay, go on. So we've got thin green bits coming off a central kind of dark brown bit mm -hmm. is that like a sprig off a christmas tree like a bit of what are they called yeah. pine needles correct it is a, a twig of a christmas tree <coughs> can i look not yet okay yeah you can look oh my goodness me look at that okay so first thoughts are that it looks metallic Maybe some sort of wrapping paper or foil, some sort of metal foil would okay. be my guess. Let me give you a little bit more information. We're going to move from whatever that was to Ooh. this. Whatever that brown thing is. It could be wood, it could be a little wooden disc. Do you want another clue? Yeah. Oh! I've turned it over, I've turned it over, I've turned okay, it over. Okay, so that's given it away. I think that that is an advent calendar chocolate. Yes! So. Here it is. You were looking at the bit of foil that wraps over the top of the chocolate. We never did find out what picture was on the advent calendar chocolate. It was a Rudolph. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> Ready? Okay, eyes, Ready. eyes closed. Can I look? Right, hang on. I'm just going to put it into... I've acquired a dog. What's that? That? So it's yellowy orange with kind of a black mottled... And it's natural. Is it a bit of a flower? It's not a flower, but the colour will give it away. Well, it's orange. Is it an orange? Yes, is but that actually, an orange? look at this. <gasps> look at is that, that. Is that the bit at the top? It is, yes. That's really cool. Isn't that amazing? What a beautiful pattern. Congratulations, you guessed right. It was a Satsuma. It was actually a bit of Satsuma peel. I always get one in the bottom of my stocking every single Christmas. So that's why I picked it. Are you ready for this? I'm ready for this. This is the last one. Focus it up. Ooh. Do you think you've got okay. there? That to me looks like a bit of plastic. Yep. 
Yeah. Move it up a bit because I think I know what it is, but I need to see this bit that you're hiding. Whoa. Let me move to. Wow. Oh Look my goodness me. It looks like the top of a bottle. Okay, so let's slowly <gasps> move down. Oh my gosh. Have you got it yet? Have you worked it out? I think that this is a Christmas fairy light bulb. It is a oh, fairy wow. light bulb. Yeah. All right. So this is so cool. <gasps> oh my gosh, look at that. It's like a spring. Well, it kind of is. Right. This this is going to explain how fairy lights work, all right? So what happens is when you connect them in to the electricity, the electricity flows up this big wire at the side here and it flows through what looks like a spring and that's called a filament and then back down the other wire and then onto the next light and up and across the filament and down but when the electricity flows through that filament there that coil of wire it gets really hot and when it gets really hot it glows and that is what you see as the light um do you want to see it yes please right okay i'm going to try to do this one two three Whoa! Oh wow, it looks like it's on fire. Very good. I like that one. I think that might have been my favourite one. <laughs> but that is the end of our Christmas close-up challenge. I hope you enjoyed playing along at home. Definitely let us know how many you guessed and which was your favourite one in the comments below. If you are watching this on the Curious Christmas calendar playlist, then make sure you stick around for the final videos because Christmas is drawing near and we've got lots more Christmassy themed videos coming up. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, stay curious, and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. So many cameras. <laughs>